guys, it's Mark from Day Did You Win, and I want to tell you about the next product that I have the opportunity of testing out and reviewing as being a member of the Bib Brave Pro program. If you're not familiar with what a Bib Brave Pro is, basically what we are able to do, it's a running community where we are able to uh, test products, give our honest feedback on those products, as well as also uh, run certain races and give our reviews on those races as well. Um, you can check out my reviews on daydidyouwin.wordpress.com. Uh, you can also check out my word, my race reviews on bibrave.com, and you can find my races there um, as well. So let's go ahead and check out what I've got uh, for today. It just came in the mail today. It's a relatively cheap product, uh, inexpensive, I mean, not as far as quality, but inexpensive as um, it's not going to cost you a whole lot, but it's probably also going to save you some money on your running wardrobe. So let's go ahead and check that out, and I'll tell you all about it. So today's product comes from a company called Bib Boards. What Bill, Bib Boards is, and I'm going to open it up right now and show you, is that if you are familiar with races, obviously, then you know what the standard thing that comes with your race packet to put your bibs on your shirt is basically a, a set of four safety pins. Now, let me show you what my safety pins have done to this uh, singlet here. I'm going to try to give you a good view of this. But I don't know if you can tell, there are actually holes wearing out. There you go, you can see right there. Uh, there are holes that are wearing out my singlet here. Pretty good there. There we go. There, there's a good look at it. So say no more to the holes and take a look at bib boards. Basically what they are, they are little clips. Take one off. There we go. They basically stick this insert on the inside of your shirt, this on the outside through the bib, and voila, you stick them on like that. So, for instance, here I got three sets here actually. I, I requested the special 26.2, go figure. I like my marathons. But then they also sent me on a mock bib, if you will, another set. So basically, what you do, and my understanding is these are a little bit more difficult the first time. After you start messing with them a few times, they kind of uh, go come on and off quite easily. But at the same time, you don't want them coming off easily. So this is a good start. So basically, uh, pretend that this is on uh, on top of a shirt. Put this on the put the uh, disc here on the inside of your shirt. Line it up with the hole of your bib, and you just simply snap it on. Pretty nice system. Um, I'm actually going to have a great opportunity to test this out this weekend because I have half marathon on Saturday in Chicago at the F3 half marathon. Um, and so I will try these out then. But what this, well, the reason why this system is so great compared to your pins, of course, you're not wearing uh, wearing holes in the pins of, or on the, in the singlet from the safety pins. Also, you know, some of you might be familiar more with the uh, magnet system that another company has. And you know what? Honestly, I've tried the magnets before, and I've lost the magnets um, got too, while wearing them. Got too close to uh, metal, and the magnets just came right off and stuck to that uh, metal, and I lost them. So this, I hope, is a great alternative to pins and a whole lot better than magnets. So we're going to take a shot at these on Saturday, and... Uh, I'll let you guys know what I think here in a couple weeks. Have a great day, guys.